Hello and welcome, my name is Ashley and today we're going to be starting our new Let's Play series where we try and take an unemployed, unqualified manager right from the bottom of world football to surpass the likes of Sir Alex Ferguson, Pep Guardiola and Jose Mourinho. We're going to be starting unemployed with no qualifications and you can see here by my profile we have zero attributes apart from adaptability, which we're going to be using to try and get some job offers from other countries, Sunday league footballer and no coaching badges. This is the hardest setting to have in football manager. And we're going to be treating this as a realistic save, i.e. if we receive job offers from clubs where we maybe don't like them, but they're offering us new money and good money, realistically in real life would take them. So we're going to be playing with realism mode turned on as it were. Straight away then, we can see that I have applied for some jobs. Here are all the jobs available. We're not going to be looking at the likes of Celtic and Ipswich and Northampton. Realistically, the only two that we, I think we've got a chance of getting here is Wellstone and Spennymore. Um, it may take us six months to get a job. It may take us one week. I don't know. That's the beauty of this save. If you start employed, Footman just, just throws you in and you end up where you end up and have to deal with it. So we'll be back shortly, hopefully with some uh, news on job offers and hopefully some clubs take an interest in us. I'll see you shortly. And so we have had our very first uh, interview. Uh, we've had two of them in fact. Worldstone have come in and offered us an interview and so have Morton somewhere there. So we've had two interviews. Um, we're going to attend. Let's get down to business. Uh, we're, yes, we're trying to forge ahead with our career because we haven't actually got one yet. Um, happy to work with them. Uh, mid table is absolutely fine. Transfer funds. Oh, we'll have money. Money at Morton. Wow, that's impressive. And 12,000 a week looks good to me. Nice and easy there. Worldstone offering us an interview too. Well, um, not, a bit of a travel there from. Um, Worldstone to Morton for quick interviews. Hopefully during this era of COVID, it's just over Zoom. But uh, yeah, again, we're trying to forge ahead. We're happy. Avoiding relegations, fine. Wage budget less than Morton, interesting. Uh, and no requests. We're just going to uh, give them what they want, say we're happy. Hopefully one of them comes back with an offer. And we have had an offer. Worldstone have approached us. The question now is, do we delay and wait for the Morton job. Um, I wasn't expecting to get a job this quickly, I must admit. Um, looking at some of the other jobs that are still out there, we haven't heard back from Spennymore. Um, Worldstone are in the National League. Wow, I, I mean, to get a job in the National League first time is, is a bit scary. I mean, they've just got promoted 150 to one, third worst team in the division. Um, yeah, you know, could be could be interesting. Um, phew, tough decision, tough decision. I think I'm going to take it. I don't think we're in a position where we can turn down job offers. The National League is a tough league to be in, to start in. Um, but avoiding relegation is all they want. So what we're going to do is we are going to take it. We're uh, going to ask for an extra... 25 quid. This doesn't seem to work in FM21 at all. Oh, it does work. We got an extra 25 quid. There we go. 800 pounds, one month contract, finalize the deal, advance, and we should have our opportunity to say hello to everybody. Eyebrows have been raised at the appointment of the 26 year old. Uh, agreed. I mean, no one knows who we are. We're coming in very much in the outside. There's no previous experience. Uh, we've got a 3,200 capacity stadium. Grosvenor Vale, uh, basic, basic and poor, uh, you know, that needs some work if we are going to turn this into a long-term Worldstone save, um, whether we are here for long-term, I don't know. Um, I don't know anything about them. I mean, they play, they won the title apparently last year. And, uh, best Belgium in the 1980s. They won the fifth tier in 84. They won the FA Trophy in 85 and the sixth tier in, FA in 2020. Um, yeah, not a lot of history. Not a lot of history, um, but some history. Some history, which is good for this level. Uh, they're a South team. I'm generally not from the South myself, so uh, that would be interesting. Um, 
They play in a 4-3-3, or the suggestion is to play in a 4-3-3, which I think is good because I like a 4-3-3. Um, so we can work with that. And the expectation, as we say, to avoid relegation and try and become an established National League team over two years. We're only one year contract, so the first one is simple. Uh, yeah, we'll have all that. Thank you very much. Excellent. So we now have a job. First things, first parts down, we have a job. So tomorrow we will then be having a look at our squad in a big de in a bit more detail. Uh, what we'll do is have a quick look at the club info. Um, contracts need some redoing. Everyone's on holiday at the moment. Star player apparently is Meekings. Meekings is our star player. <coughs> He's a centre back, uh, 183 centimetres. Uh, heading pretty good. Um, yeah, he looks all right for this level. He looks he looks pretty good. Reports from, are saying that he is a good player at this level, which I think is about where I'd say he's about right. Um, yes, so we look forward to starting tomorrow with our new club, Wildstone.